Viewer asks if an SSPX layperson would be able to receive sacraments from Father Jenkins or another Society of St. Pius V priest. Well, generally speaking, yes. We, when we have a, pre, uh, a Catholic person come to us from one of the Society of St. Pius X chapels, we assume that they are traditional Catholics. Uh, obviously, we don't agree with uh, a number of the positions taken by the Society of St. Pius X. There are many, many good people who go to uh, the traditional Mass. They go to, the, it's a 1962, John the Twenty Third changed version of the of the liturgy of the traditional mass but um, they go there looking for the traditional faith and to practice the traditional faith and they are catholics they have the the traditional faith in its integrity those people do come to, and receive communion with us and we do not turn them away as we go down the communion rail we don't ask people what they think of francis we don't ask people do you accept francis or not do you reject him or do you accept him do you think he's a true pope or do you reject him and say he's an anti-pope? We don't ask people that question because, uh, again, we see that uh, it's not up to us to, uh, as it were, solemnly defined, define the infallible answer to that question. We're not the magisterium of the church. We can't pretend to be. So we, we don't have that as some kind of a loyalty oath or anything of the kind or some kind of a test question to know whether people get received communion or not. If I have people come to me from uh, the Society of St. Pius X for Mass and come to the communion rail to receive communion, I don't ask them if they, uh, if they adhere to the Society of St. Pius X's view on Francis or not. I don't know if they even know what it is, frankly. But uh, I presume they're going to the Society of St. Pius X because they want to practice the traditional Catholic faith. In answer to this questioner, I guess, mm. yes. <laughs> <laughs> right.